Good day all. Welcome back. Today we are going to do life lesson 9. Practice makes a man perfect. This is an old proverb which we keep hearing but I'll relate to you about a story. In the good old days in Indian ecosystem we had the gurukuls and the students used to go to the gurukuls. And in one of the gurukuls there were multiple students who were studying there and there was a boy who was called Varad Raja. And he was sent by his parents to the Gurukul under the tutelage of the Guru there. And he was being taught along with the other students. Varad Raja was not an intelligent student at all. He was taught for an year. He was given all the education which he needed. But he was weak in his studies. Because of his weakness in his studies, what we could observe and find was that he was not able to pass the class. He could not get promoted to the next class. What it meant, he was completely disappointed. Guruji spent a lot of time on him. The students started ridiculing him and he was not able to move forward. And the Guruji spent extra time with him and wanted to teach him further, but he couldn't see any positive movement in Varad Raja's studies. Varad Raja was then instructed by the Guruji that I have spent a lot of time. What you should do is you should go back home. You should help your parents in the household course. With a lot of disappointment and unhappiness, Varad Raja came back home. And he started helping the household activities and the course which was given to him by his parents. In one of these days when he was feeling thirsty, he walked down to the well. When he walked down to the well, he looked down upon the well to pick the bucket of water. He found that on the stones, there was marks and there was women around the well. So he asked to the group of women, what happened? How does the stone get the mark? The woman related that the rope which is there to pull the bucket of water if it keeps hitting the hard stones, it gets the mark. He said the rope is very soft, but he said over a period, he was told over a period of time, when the rope keeps hitting, it creates a mark. Then came an enlightenment to him. Varaj Raja understood that with effort and lot of time and lot of patience and lot of practice, if the stone can make, get a mark of the rope, which is of so soft in nature, why can't I make the difference? He went back to the Gurukul, he started studying and over a period of time, what he was able to build was classic. He was the one after a few years, he became not only a great teacher, but a Sanskrit grammar who composed the Siddhanta Kumudi, the Madhya Siddhanta Kumudi, the Sara Siddhanta Kumudi and the Griha Padman, Padmana Yaraji. And what it means is very simple. Practice is very important, whether it is sports, studies, any discipline which you pick up. You cannot succeed without success. And for that, you have to keep practicing. If you merely sit there thinking luck will come and without practice, you will be able to reach what you want to do. There is nothing else but regret which will come your way. Therefore, putting practice, putting patience, having hard work and perseverance and keep on doing what you want to do will help you to reach your destination. With that, we come to the end of life lesson 9, where we say practice makes a man perfect. Thank you so much for watching my video. Keep watching. If you want to like my video, please like the, please press the like button. If you want to subscribe to my channel, please subscribe by pressing the subscription button. Thank you so much. Keep watching. Have a good day ahead.